all we're going to do is just look at some of the photos. Yeah, okay. And then I'll, I'll write up. I'll write down what they are. Yeah, I will. And then okay. if there are any if there are any stories behind yes. them. Uh, there are a lot of royal ones, so I don't think we'll be able to use them. And I copyright of the former Prince of Wales. My father with them. Um, yeah, the you'd Duke have Windsor. Yes, you'd have to get permission to use things These like that. These are the dead, yeah. anyhow. It's the uh, family dead. ones that are very nice. I initially thought that was here, but it's not, is it? Unless that's when you were developing the place. I've never seen it. Haven't you? Could be Mary, possibly. I don't oh, it's, it's you and Mary. Yeah. This is definitely you. The That's me. The seat behind you says Canadian Pacific. Oh, I love that. That's you on the royal tour, isn't it? Yes, it is. Yeah. Oh, I met Mickey Brown in the basement of the Special Forces Club in London way back in 1990 when I was researching a book about his commando days. I was introduced to this bevy of rather mature-looking, fierce gentlemen whose duty that day was to decide whether or not I was a suitable candidate for their personal histories. And it seems that one of the people I impressed most was Mickey Byrne. And then he invited me to come out here to spend a weekend with him. My approach at that time was to find out about his days in the army. But over the course of the weekend, I got to realize that there was a much more complex individual there someone who had, within the scope of his life, uh, virtually a complete history of the 20th century. Most of the other men had the raid to talk about or their days in the commandos. There wasn't that much before or since, whereas you realized that the commando episode was really quite a, a small one in a life of significant episodes. Uh, Rippers 113 Alpha and Bravo, they're both active, open and active, and you've been asked to make clear that, and, and likewise for Delta 115. Any of the other range you want me to check on? Stop by, whiskey, whiskey. I flew a plane once, when I was 19. Can you remember what sort of plane it was? It was uh, in 1939. 1939? They were gold mine. Wow. Wonderful. And, and I went to Perth about it and started. Not everyone that's been sent sunburned at 25 below. Uh. 25 below. And I was in my shirt sleeves. Oh. Do we eat poetry? Not enough. Not enough. 